Hello everybody, this is Johnny Wu here with MDI. I'm here to talk about the Kane 7000, which is a three axis brushless key gimbal, which I also want to talk about a electronic stabilizer for your camera. Uh, in this particular, particular case, this is a camera gimbal for any camera weights up to 6.6 .6 pounds, which is about 2.5 kilogram. Uh, what is this better than the other one is because this not only is cheaper than most of the one you see on Kickstarter, only about less than thousand dollars. You can also be able to build this yourself and learn a lot, a lot more about it. Uh, before I bought this one, I have another one which completely a waste of my money and waste my time. Uh, build it, uh, it was built already, but unfortunately the quality is so bad that I returned it and I'm still waiting for my refund since January this year. So if you want to know more about this bad company, you can find out more information down below in the text. For this one, we use this Canon 70D and the Rock Canon 14mm camera lens and it works really well. We got the balance pretty good and it was very, very simple. And not only that, because of the quality of this product, you can see it was, was very sturdily made. It had very good um, settings for, for, for adjustment and so on. And the good thing about this company, the, the CamTV.com or the Cam7000 gimbal or their other gimbal system they sell, is you can find all sort of resources and videos on uh, youtube.com and there is like tons of different uh, companies actually talk about it you have the advertisement on cheesy cam you got it on nofilm.com you also have it uh, dslfilmnoob.com so all this place that you can find out more about the, the the gimbal system or the company and not only that they have a one-year warranty and they have an extremely well supported customer service so every time I have a problem, which in my case, I do break my stuff fairly quickly. So they responded back to me within 24 hours and I get my parts fairly quickly as well, if I need to get a replacement. Um, other than that, I, I actually added more stuff. I actually created a little bit more cabling system. I put a case for the controller and learning through everything that was available on, on, online, you can actually get, get this done pretty well. And for the software fine tuning for this, Make sure you check out Tom Antos, uh, films.com. Tom Antos is a very well-known cinematographer and he actually played with this. He knows about gimbal and he have a PID profile available for anybody to download for free. Get that, put it on there, and you're probably gonna have a very fairly quickly run, run about uh, settings already for your camera, but depending on how much weights and so on. So you can check out the other videos we have here about the testing of this and a couple of the funny videos we did. So hopefully you enjoyed it. So again, if you want to check out more about this product, go to camtv.com. Actually, it's cam-tv.com. See you there.